The United Nations has agreed on the key issues which the world needs to tackle by 2030. The progress towards these 17 sustainable development goals will help to lift people out of poverty, create equality between groups and enable a sustainable future. A huge problem we currently face is climate change. If we keep producing and consuming in our current way, we will continue to emit harmful greenhouse gases, which will keep heating up the earth. This will lead to extreme weather events, the melting of the polar ice caps, and extinction of vulnerable species. In addition, sea levels will rise. But luckily, there's something that we can do. Four of the UN Sustainable Development Goals are designed to help us tackle climate change to achieve a sustainable future. One solution to tackling this problem is the use of fuel cells. Fuel cells are a cleaner way of generating electricity and heat. They often use hydrogen as a fuel for this. Currently, around 55 million tonnes of hydrogen are produced a year. Mostly, the hydrogen is separated from natural gas using a process called steam methane reforming. But this also means that the carbon from the methane is separated, which reacts with the oxygen to produce CO2 and contributes to global warming. We can also use renewable electricity to power a process called electrolysis, which uses this clean source of energy to split water into hydrogen and oxygen. The hydrogen is then captured without any harmful emissions. So let's take a look at fuel cells and how they use this hydrogen. <laughs> 